Hi guys and welcome to this another video from Himanshu Agrawal channel in which we'll discuss about how to write emails that actually sells and convert for your product and services. No matter what you're doing, but if you want to send emails and you actually want people to click on those emails and then basically get converted or basically buy a product or service through those emails, then this is the perfect video for you. And here is my promise. In this particular video, I'll give you the exact format, the exact template on how to write those emails as well as I'll write a full fleshed whole email in front of you guys just to show you how simple it is to basically write those emails including the subject lines and the content so you excited let's get in hi guys so as you can see my screen i've written here PASOP, p a s o p so this is basically the template that you use to basically write your whole email the first thing is basically the problem p for problem the second thing is agitation um, the third thing is solution the solution that you are going to give the fourth thing is basically opportunity and the fifth thing is basically your another problem right now always remember when these emails when you send them you need to have a cta what do i mean by cta a cta means call to action that means in the email you ask them to click a link or do something over there so that basically you get a purchase or you get the next next action done so in this case let's say we are trying to make them book a call and on the call our duty is to sell or you can directly sell on the email itself so let's say you have a low ticket product you want to directly sell on the email or you want to send them to a sales page or a sales letter or a video i don't know you have different call to actions just remember what is your call to action before writing this email in order to get the most effectiveness out of this template right now let's back come back to this thing so first was problem problem means what problem are you solving in the email or else WIIFM which is what's in it for me simple meaning of WIIFM is what's in it for me what will I get if I read this email or if I go uh, and spend my time with this email right so that is basically a problem statement the first thing that you write in your email and I'll give you a proper example on how to do this properly then comes agitation that means now you agitate on the problem so what you do is you sprinkle salt on the wound that means the person who is uh, reading this email is having that problem that's why you have got to the second paragraph or the second line which is the agitation line that means the person is having this problem that's why he is reading on the email so you basically sprinkle some salt on the wound where you say them uh, you basically try to agitate the problem and you try to uh, make sure that they have understood the seriousness of the situation the best way to uh, agitate on the problem is to make sure to understand what are the effects if the problem is not solved so let's say the problem statement is are you trying to lose weight let's say that is your problem statement uh, 21 ways to lose lose your weight in next seven days uh, are mentioned in this email let's say you're trying to do that it's just a very bad example but uh, let's go with that now you come agitate and you basically agitate on the problem do you know that not losing weight uh, can basically make you look ugly two years down the line not losing weight can even make you less poorer um, than you are right now and not losing your fat right now can even lead to you not dating anyone something like that so what you're doing is you're, you're agitating on the problem so that the person feels the seriousness of the situation that he is in right now and uh, feels like that i need to listen to this person the f uh, third thing that you do is basically share your solution that means you try to provide them the value or uh, the answer to the problem that they're looking for basically the solution that they're looking for right so the third thing you do is basically a tell a solution so here is what you can do right that is basically your solution Ki, this is what you can do and um, this is how your problem can be solved that is the solution part with the solution one more thing that you give in the fourth part basically is opportunity that means what is the next thing they can do after solving that particular problem so that they have better lives and that is basically the opportunity part or the part where you try to sell and pitch yourself and in this part you also gain something which is called as credibility because you have already given them a solution to their problem which was their first problem if you see um, top above here was the problem you have already given a solution to that thing so uh, here is what you can do you give the solution so you basically build a trust a connection kind of thing and then you basically 
give them the opportunity that means try to sell and pitch yourself and basically give a CTA over here that is basically your call to action and uh, that is how basically you do the fourth part uh, very effectively after this what you do is basically you come to the problem two part and the problem two part is basically to create a relation with the list and we will build the whole email don't worry about that so uh, create a relation with the list that means what you're trying to do is you're telling them the opportunity click here and get yourself blah 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 and then you do thanks from Himanshu and after that you have a PS or something like that or just after the opportunity you have something where it says like if you are also looking to get the best exercise plan for losing weight then check out my next email that I will send you on Tuesday um, remember to open it because it contains that and I would also be sharing you blah 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 and bonuses blah 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 and you are basically trying to tell them that I know uh, this may not be the exact problem that you're looking for and you may not buy right now but if you want to solve the problem X or Y or Z or a different problem um, wait for my next email um, so that uh, I can help you with that what you're trying to do is create an open loop and a closed loop now what is an open loop and closed loop so um, we are uh, curious individuals as human beings now since we are curious uh, human beings what we try to do is we get some open loops in our lives and then we try to find some closed loops over there right that means uh, let's say there is a void over here in an open loop we just try to find something which can fill this void and uh, our brain is basically now a big like circle kind of thing and we have basically solved the problem that's what we are trying to do every day right now in this thing in this problem two part what you're trying to do is you're trying to create a open loop right this is an open loop that means are you looking to basically get the best exercise plan for your weight loss journey that is an open loop and the person goes like okay yeah I am looking or uh, you say something like um, I have 63 different ways on how you can uh, or I have different 63 exercises that I have um, created the biggest weight, weight loss in the industry ever now there's an open loop in the person's mind who is reading that and you basically say to close this loop that means uh, this CL what you need to do is you need to basically open my next email so since we are always trying to uh, complete this as a circle and convert this into this now you are saying ki okay this is your open loop that i've created right now to close this you need this circle or this part and for that you need to basically open my next email in order to have a complete solution and that's why when you will send the email next time all those people who would be interested would be clicking that because they remember that and they want to close that open loop in their mind also you will get more open rates more click rates and more reliability rate since now your audience is engaging and when your audience engages a lot you basically increase your relation and basically create a connection with your audience now let's just write the whole email by using the same template that I've taught you and let's say we are selling something uh, which is in the weight loss niche right so I'll choose the weight loss niche I'm not expert in that um, I'm very skinny I don't need to lose weight but still let's take the weight loss niche and we would be basically selling a consultation call and the consultation call price is let's say triple nine right that's the price of the consultation call and we are going to sell this thing that's what our plan is and we need to write now an email to our whole list which basically sells this thing right so let's get to work so the first thing that we want to discuss was problem so weight loss niche i need to sell a consultation call which tells them book a call with us so that we can help you on losing your weight are you struggling to lose weight or even worse you lose some weight and then you gain back it off that is my problem statement now what I do I just don't write this alone statement but what I do is I try to basically get um, a little bit more content around the same problem right so let's think together so are you struggling to lose weight or even worse you lose some weight and then you gain back it up What else can we write to make this problem even better looking to the customer? Now that's your research part, what you need to do. But let's think something that we can do over here.
okay so this is basically my problem statement that i'm writing obviously this can be done better and it depends on you you need to spend some time and think about it and make the language clear and the spelling mistake and everything i'm just trying to give you example of where so that is my problem statement now i agitated on the problem So that is my agitation part where I basically just agitated on the problem, whatever the problem statement was, I just tried to just put some salt on the wound so that the person feels the seriousness of the situation and feels like, okay, this is a serious thing that I need to solve right now. Now, since I've told you the problem, I've told you the agitation, now comes the solution part. So I now will basically write the solution part um, and see how it goes. Now what I did was basically I gave the solution. So I gave a solution in the way of there is only one and only one solution to this whole problem. It's called the XYZ method. Now you can share whatever the method you have or some IP intellectual property that you or whatever you want to name it. You can name something which is the XYZ method. So basically what you need to do is and you basically explain that what do you mean by that XYZ method. Now you can give a logical explanation of that and now what you need to make sure is that whatever solution you're giving it's half solution and by half solution I mean they know exactly what to do, but they don't know how to do it. So for example, what I can write over here, let's say I'm selling my program and I say, so there is only one and one solution to this problem, uh, which is to do more email marketing and basically increase your delivery rate, open rate and closure rate. Let's say I route this. Now who is reading that will get value and understand, okay, so I need three things over here. That is this, this and this, but they don't exactly know how to increase their open rates, conversion rates and closing rate. They don't know that or delivery rate. They don't know that. So now I have the opportunity to pitch them something and that's where the fourth part comes, which is opportunity. So here is how it goes. Okay, so basically what I did is write the opportunity part. So what I've written is, so for that reason, uh, what I have is a consultation call for you and only four spots, which creates a kind of scarcity and urgency in which I will exactly understand the problem you are having and share with the exact system behind XYZ method so that you can get dash benefits and the dash benefits are in the problem statement that you have already written. Or else you can write something else also and dash features or whatever you want to write. Just make the opportunity feel appealing. And then you basically give a call to action. We just click here to book a call and you basically give the link over here and that's how you do the opportunity part and then what you can do is thanks and let's say I close out by saying Himanshu and then after that and what I can do over here is yes if you are looking this is basically uh, the problem to part when you're creating open when you close to. and done that's done right so as you can see we like we uh, wrote a whole email in like less than 
um, 10 30 minutes in which we have exactly written everything and now you can you need to edit it obviously you need to uh, find some things new and you want to basically uh, make things better but this is how you exactly write the email hope you liked it but there is one thing remaining which is the subject line that means how do you write the subject line so what i'll give you i'll give you five to six templates that you can use on subject lines so here are those five uh, six subject lines that i was talking about and the first thing you need to always remember is that curiosity is the mother of subject lines if your subject line is not curious nobody will open your emails and always remember the goal of the subject line is not to make them buy a product the goal of the subject line is to just make them open the email and the goal of the content of the email is just to make them click the link and the goal of that sales page or that video is basically to make the sale and that's how the funnel goes but do not make sure that your subject line is something which is trying to sell them your subject line is just to make uh, someone curious about what is the email about and click them on the email so here are the five um, things that uh, five templates that you can use um, to basically um, get good subject lines so that is how to dash without dash in dash so how to lose weight without exercise in seven days right how to make money without internet in three days so basically what you're doing is you're basically trying to just fill out these things how to dash that means get the desire without the thing that they don't like in dash time that is a very appealing time dash ways to dash 23 ways to lose weight 67 ways to make money 43 ways to date woman whatever right so you basically um, just pull out these numbers and you can play on with them stop doing dash so stop going to college so what you're doing you're just trying to take something that is in their belief system of your customers belief system and just putting it over here and telling them this is wrong right so stop doing webinars stop doing youtube videos stop watching netflix whatever you are just trying to do something over there which basically contradicts with them and when there is a contradict they try to open it just to prove it that you may be wrong and that's why your job is done as you wanted to make them open the email and dash reason is the dash 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 is the reason for dash that means um, dash thing is the reason for dash failure which is um, email marketing is the reason for your business failure diet is the reason for no weight loss whatever this thing is basically the reason for your failure that you your customer basically gets every time and dash thing should be a popular one so that uh, it makes them curious like what this email is about and the last thing is dash can create dash for you so email marketing can create uh, wealth for you investing can create wealth for you um, diet can create weight loss for you and basically what you can do is try to some something funny over here so that it correlates with this also but also builds a curiosity so for example is webcams can create extraordinary wealth for you now that is something that you would be curious about you like what is this and you try to open that email and then basically the content structure in such a way that the person clicks the link and eventually buys uh, the product that you're looking for so hope you got value out of this video subscribe to the channel if you haven't i'll put the link in the description to check the software that i use to basically send emails every time um, like this video so that the youtube baba becomes happy and uh, thank you so much for watching